fucking piece of shit. <clears throat> Hey, Doom Kid. How you doing, buddy? Oh. I haven't seen Captain Marvel. I don't know. <clears throat> And I can't speak for its quality one way or the other. Uh, I've not seen Us yet. What's with the terrorist beard? I don't know. I didn't know it was a terrorist beard. Osama bin TJ. I love. <laughs> uh, uh, mm. I look like a blonde Osama. Blonde Osama bin Laden. Uh, cool. I'm, I guess I'm a Muslim now because of my beard. That's pretty neat. Yeah, I wish I had Osama Bin Laden levels of money. What does CX, CX, C mean? Thoughts on Noam Chomsky. He, uh, is, he exists. What the fuck is CX? I don't know no CX. Blonde Sama Bin Flaxen. Good stuff. TJ Bin Rockin. CX is Ice Poseidon. Okay. Big Chief is closed on 419 for Easter. Are we supposed to go in there on 420? Rocking TJ is the best TJ. You're the best TJ. Fucking piece of shit. Uh, do you think any of the financial investigations of Trump will make any difference? Uh, I have no idea. I see a lot of people jump into conclusions. But no one really knows what was in Mueller's report yet, so we'll see. I know it's been submitted. TG, are you leaving the EU? Yeah. TG exit. I'm done with the EU. Fuck them. Speed up. No. I like your streams more, TJ. At least I can say stupid shit here without worry about getting banned. That's not true. I've definitely banned people before. One day, TJ will rock so hard they will fall over. Okay. Uh, no, I've never been in a bad car accident. I've been in a few fender benders. Oh, the, there are separate financial investigations of Trump not related to the Mueller investigation? Well, I don't know. You can't watch the stream in 1.5x speed. The streams don't work that way. I can't speed up reality. 
Yeah, mod pizza was pretty good. What phone do I have? Um, I think it's a Note. It's like the latest Note. It's broken. The screen's broken right down there. You can't see it because, you know, it'd be impossible unless I could, like, bend the camera. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the screen is cracked for no reason. Yeah, I guess I could put it in a mirror, but eh, it's not worth it to me. Damn, TJ, break the damn chair already. Why would the chair break? It's a rocking chair. It's meant for this. Uh, TJ, you remember talking to me on Skype and sending me butt pics about six years ago? Uh, no. I don't remember that. Qantas never crashed. Cool. Why you rocking, TJ? Because I do. I don't know. Hook a generator up to that chair. That's true. We could power the whole nation. Andrew Yang is looking for interviews. Why not jump on that? I sent uh, Andrew Yang's Twitter a request for an interview. Like, shortly after his Joe Rogan appearance. And uh, I got no response, but maybe I could follow up. I hope you have a neat day, TJ. Thank you. I hope it's neat. I hope it's a neato burrito day. Yeah. Bring Paul and Scotty to what? Morocco, the Taco Obama. How's the weather lately? Um, fine, I guess. It's pretty moderate day. Vital. Vital is awesome, dude. Do not challenge the might of Vital. Pork fried rice burrito. What are you doing, Sal? There once was a man named Paul whose chest was round as a ball. He farted all day, was totally gay, and his prick, of course, was small. That's pretty good. I'll give that one a B. You get a B. Hi, TJ. Hi, Swegta. What's up, bitch? Uh, should we keep tax breaks for people with kids? No. Why should we encourage that? Almost forgot to give you money. Yeah. Oops. Can't wait for DFF End of America. That'll be a good one. The Collapse of America. Will you mod me if I get an A+. Plus? Um, sure. Yeah, if you do, if you give me an A+, plus Limerick, I'll mod you. Is Stevie editing the new Dungeons and Dragons? Uh, no. Uh, Taylor is editing it. How much do you have to pay me for a private lap dance? Uh, I don't know, $692.41. Why are you moving back and forth? Why aren't you? Why does Scotty sound beta? You'd have to ask Scotty about that. Oh. 
Virgin TJ versus Chat Scoopy. I don't understand. Oh boy, I come into the stream and you're already rocking back and forth. Well, I always rock back and forth. There's no time when I'm not doing that, so. This is a rather gay day. Good. Gay day, gay day. Why does uh, Jesus have a Mexican name? That's true. Jesus. Die for your sins, Holmes. It's the best Mexican voice I can do. It's pretty sad. Uh, Amish Mafia needs you, TJ. No, I don't want to. I don't want to. Four Chan TV. Sounds lame. Uh, when is your when is the next Howard Bloom interview? Um, I don't know. I'd like to get someone who has like strongly pro-Israel or anti-Israel views to argue with Howard about Israel. So I gotta find the right person to do that, and then I'll maybe stage a debate. Uh, how long are you going to let Paul leech off your talent? Uh, three or four more years. Will you ever go back on the Joe Rogan uh, podcast? Um, I don't know. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 420. Cool. What do you like to do? Uh, nothing. Just watch the X Files. Paul makes the show at this point. Cool. Own Paul. Own him. Own him. Trap porn. Yeah, it could be pretty cool. Do 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 Um What shows am I currently watching? The X Files. I wanna watch I'm trying to fucking com be an X Files completist and watch the entire series. Which I've tried to do in the past, but I've always kinda tapped out at some point. But this time I'm gonna get through it. I'm gonna know. I'm gonna know the whole story start to finish. It's hard because some of the episodes of the X-Files are really fucking bad. But some are really good. You just gotta fucking sift through the terrible ones to get to the great ones. Most are just kind of mediocre. But, yeah. The world was made from a shart. When God attempted to fart, he squeezed his cheeks tight, and with a great fight, it tore his butthole apart. I still think that's in the B range. I don't like that you rhymed fart with shart, because they're already kind of related words. The rhymes, if, you, if you're going for an A+, the rhymes have to be more unexpected and clever. Movie with heart and no brain or movie with brain and no heart? Which do you prefer? Um, I guess a uh, heart with no brain. Depends on what the heart is, though, because, you know, I don't want it to just be like some sappy bullshit, but if the movie is all about, you know, I, I don't know, like it has like some kind of machismo to it or some shit, like an old fucking Schwarzenegger movie from the 80s, that can be totally brainless and I'll get into it. Does the sorceress have heart? No. 
It has no heart or brains, but it is lovably stupid, so. Uh, TJ, are you an alpha or beta male? Uh, I don't know. I'm an omega male. I'm the last of my kind. Do, do I like combing my hair? No. How long you plan on staying in Louisiana? I don't know. Until I don't have to anymore, I guess. How often do I wash my hair? I don't know, once every three or four days. No, I don't think I'd ever move back to Ohio. I might visit. There's a few things in Ohio that I do miss, but I don't think I could ever move there. It's just too boring. Hush. Roof. Roof! Roof! Sal! Stop barking. Move to Spain. I don't want to do that. It sounds really lame. A dialogue between a, a man and a beast. But who is the man and who is the beast? That is the true question. Move to Guatemala. Cool. Favorite song you recently been listening to? Um, I don't really have anything I've been listening to recently, music-wise. I've been in kind of an anti-music phase. Not like against music, I just haven't really been listening to much. Other than like when I'm driving around in my car scanning for something on like uh, the, the Sirius XM radio. Move to Brazil. Come worship Bolsonaro with us. Yes, the great Bolsonaro. Destroy the rainforest, Bolsonaro. Yes, yes. Persecute me, Bol Bolsonaro. Persecute me good. What's my body type? I don't know, fat? <laughs> move to the moon. Why would I want to move to the fucking moon? Bolsonaro sounds like a type of vinegar. I always thought it sounded like an Italian dish. But whatever. Do you pretend like you know everything? Legit asking. No, it's too much work to pretend like you know everything. It's better to just fess up to your ignorance. Utah needs you, TJ. Uh, well, I don't need Utah, so... They're just going to have to go without somehow. <sighs> Did you see Repsion's video about Onision? Is that a joke? Because there's like 9,000 of them. Um, wolf which country has the coolest flag I don't know I, I kind of like our flag honestly you know most countries have pretty basic fucking flags it's like it's three stripes you know it's like eh. at least ours has got like a bunch of stripes and some stars and shit Merca. We need some cooler flags, though. I mean, the world 
You know, when entire countries get together and come up with a symbol for themselves, I feel like it should be something cooler than just like, we got three stripes or, you know, there's like a big star or something. The Confederate flag is a pretty good flag, you know, just setting aside all the fucking politics of it and shit. You know, on its own, it's a pretty decent flag. Soviet Union had a pretty dope flag, yeah. We need more flags with, like, dragons and skulls and shit on them, you know? Some nations should adapt the pirate flag as their national flag. Couldn't Ant-Man just, like, crawl in Thanos' ear and then stand on his brain and then get really big and then blow Thanos' head up with his body? That'd be pretty neat. I don't see how Thanos could counter that movie over. Movie fucking over. How do you do? I don't know. I'm fine, I guess. Do you like Hannibal, the TV show? I've never seen it. Do I think the world will end with a whimper or a shout? Um, probably a whimper. Things will just kind of like steadily decline until, you know, it's just all over. But it'll just be like kind of a fizzle, like a wet fart ends the world. Bottoms up at the club, TJ. I don't know what you're yammering about. The steady decline of society. Oh. Hello, TJ J Doe. What? I don't know what TJ Doe means. TJ Doe. TJ Doe. And push, and shout, and scream. Ow. Fucking door. Yeah, I've been meaning to oil those hinges. They have been pretty loud as of late. It's a little... <clears throat> Screeching noise. Now, my wife is working out in there. Yeah. Why wear a hat indoors? Are you bald? I mean, my hairline's pretty high. But I don't really have a bald spot or anything. I just like hats. Well, that's terrible. Look at that. Why the fuck aren't you working out with her? Because I'm fat and lazy. Do da cardio, Chi J. No. What was the darkest moment of your life? Probably when all the lights went out. It was really dark. What cigarette brand do I usually smoke? I don't usually smoke it, I always smoke it. It's American Spirit, light green. Damn.
if you if you and Paul woke up in a Freaky Friday situation, what would you do in his body? It really wouldn't even be a change. I'd just go from being one fat bearded guy to a different fat bearded guy. So there's not even really much of a fucking plot there. Paul is considerably fatter, though. I don't really know about that. I mean, he is fatter, but I don't know if he's considerably fatter. I think his fat is just distributed differently. Because his all just tends to be like, bloop. Mine kind of spreads out across the body. AJ Darke. You're a nerd. Okay. Good stuff. Uh, I've been here 26 minutes and there hasn't been a single good, intelligent question that led to any sort of thought-provoking answer. You guys suck pretty bad today. That's okay, though. I forgive you. Because it's not like I'm fucking teeming over with good ideas at the moment. Would you like to visit the compound where Osama bin Laden was killed? No. What do I give a shit about that? Is nationalism a good or a bad thing, or is it not so black and white? It's not so black and white. I mean, there's different types of nationalism. There's different types of national identity. You know, so I don't, I don't know that it's necessarily a bad thing inherently. I don't consider myself a nationalist, but I don't think that everyone who is is evil or something. I see a lot of people acting like the only kind of nationalism is white nationalism. That's really strange. That's not true. Uh, my friend said nihilism drains our moral compass. What do you opinion? Um, yeah, it does, and it should, because the moral compass is bullshit. Um, how do you think the DNC will attack Bernie this time? Oh, uh, well, they'll try the Russia thing. Uh, they'll try saying that he's out of touch because he's old and he doesn't understand black people. Um, they've already done all this, by the way. This is not a prediction. This is just a statement of what they're already doing. You know, I've read so many articles like, you know, can Bernie compete in these more diverse states because he doesn't do well with racial minorities, even though he's polling well with them now. I don't know. I've seen him try to do the, uh, the Russia thing on him, but, you know, if this Mueller report finds no collusion from Trump which it seems like initially people are kind of feeling like it doesn't, then, you know, the Russia attack is going to be ultra limp. I think it already was pretty limp, but... Uh, what's my opinion of UBI? I like it. I think it's a good idea. Make more Kovar videos, please. All right. A black thumbs down. Brutal. Make a wrong advices as Kovar. That's not a bad idea, really. What stops you more from getting in shape? The laziness of working out or giving up your favorite foods? Both, but probably more the former.
Would you vote for Kyle if he ran for president? Probably. Yeah. I mean, even if I didn't agree with his policies, I'd probably vote for him just because I know him. Be like, yeah, I have someone I know be president. That'd be cool. But I don't see that happening. Pundits tend to pund. They don't tend to run for office. Because running for office does involve a certain level of bullshit. Whereas when you're a pundit, you don't want to really be beholden to that. Yo. Yeah. Anyway. I think I'm going to wrap this up. Because I got some work to do. I was hoping you guys would get my creative juices going.